What's going on, everybody? It's Big T back with another episode of Daisy. Thank you all so much for tuning into the series and showing love to it. I do appreciate it. Last time we left off here, we were headed towards what I now know is indeed Electro. Um, we're headed towards Electro. We started a brand new life here on the Easy server. Um, that gives us a handy dandy map down there because I, I suck pretty bad and you know, I'm, I'm trying to learn and, uh, and get better. Um, last episode, you know, we had a little betrayal happen and, um, you know, it's, it's cutthroat out here. It's, it's dog eat dog. You know, this is the apocalypse, whatever. And, um, people gotta die. You know, somebody's gotta die. Somebody's gotta do it. So might as well be them and not me. Um, Let's go ahead and open up some of these military hats. What is that? A hook. Not sure what to do with that. Um, hmm. Okay, I was going to go straight into Electro, but now I'm intrigued with this place. <gasps> what is this place? Cause if I didn't know any better, I'd, I'd say it looks like a military encampment. And if that's the case by God, they might have some good stuff for us. KA wooden handguard. Got glow sticks, uh, better pants. What kind of pants do I have on right now? Just normal ass jeans. Didn't want to do that. Okay, what if I take the pants off? Now I have no pants on. And then put those on there. Picked up some liver pate last time. Okay. Takes me so long to loot. Box 9x19s, that is good for the pistol that we have currently. <clears throat> Go ahead and unbox these. You heard that? We got shots fired. I do not believe that was on the island though. That actually sounded closer to Electro. Oh, here we go. 75 round drum mag. Which might be good. Wooden hand guard. Oh, here's a better backpack for us. Yeah. Now we got a utility backpack. Just gotta make sure I keep keep my wits about me. All these doors are closed. Which makes me think we're the only ones here. But at the same time, what if that's somebody's plan? Like if I was really trying to be an asshole? Oh, fantastic. We got a canteen. Okay. Your shots again? Like if I wanted to be an asshole and I had all the time in the world, I would just come around to an area, close all the doors, tidy up, you know, make it look pristine and undiscovered, and then just like sit up in a tower or something or lay down in the grass and wait, and then just fucking ambush and take everybody's stuff. If I wasn't recording for YouTube videos, I would literally, <laughs> I'd, be, uh, I'd be such an asshole. I would do the most boring stuff, but I feel like it would be fun. Like just lay in the grass for two hours until somebody came by me. Like get a, get a real experience.
Okay. Now we've got, uh, it's a plastic bottle, but I just got a canteen, so like. What do we think? Try to sound horror a little bit. There's no door right there. Hold up. Boots. Oh! I found a dry sack. I know what that's for. Yo, should I do it now? That'd be crazy. I can't do it while you motherfuckers are watching though. I already told y'all what server I play on. Y'all just come dig my shit up. I should bury that. I should absolutely bury that. I might do that at the end of the the end of the session, honestly. Um Man, more 9 by 19s okay. Oh, an NBC hood. Okay. So now I've got the hood and the jacket. Sooner or later, I will, I will go to the uh, contaminated area. Dude, my guy's still fucking gagged. Can we... Get the gag out of his mouth. I don't know. He's a fucking freak, though. What are you gonna do? What is that? A Vega buttstock. In a combat jacket. 42? Same as I got. Alright, let me get up in this tower real quick and just see. This was just a bit of a... A bit of a detour, if I'm being honest. I just kind of wanted to check it out. Because it looked, uh, looked military-esque. So I thought maybe I'd find some kind of automatic rifle or something, but... No luck, it seems. Alright, here we go. I'm going to keep on running towards Electro. And we're about to get it done. Coming up on the very outskirts of Electro. I'm going to pull the pistol out just because if I really need the, whatchamacallit, PSO1 scope, will that go? Ooh, I'll take. I guess I don't really need that on my <clears throat> rifle. I like to always keep the short range weapon out because I would much rather have the short range weapon out but need my long range, which means somebody's far away, than to have my long range weapon out but need my short range weapon, which means somebody's up in my shit. You understand what I'm saying? I don't know if that logic holds up, but that's how I've always thought about it. Ah, uh, 45 ACP rounds. I don't what I need is a submachine gun, motherfucker. Can I get an SG-5K? Going in hot. Got boots and boots and more boots. Oh, 
Oh, and gloves. Do I have? Oh, I don't have gloves. All right. Tactical gloves. Don't see anybody chasing us. Dude, I swear I used to always get the best shit out of this building and now it's a whole lot of nothing. Yo, flashbang though. Give me that. I have no idea how to use grenades. I tried to use a smoke the other day and I fucking smoke bombed myself. I uh, probably should not try to flashbang. Dang, but sniping from up here? Wait, what is this? Oh, my camera just died. What's this gun though? That's a PP Bison. Um, yeah, swap that bitch with the crossbow. Don't nobody want that. Uh, I gotta put my other. I gotta put my other camera in. Hang on, one sec. My other battery. Hopefully this one lasts, but, um, you know, if not, then it was nice seeing you. <gasps> I'd still keep the video going. You just wouldn't be able to see me. Um, okay. So we got the PP bison. Um, oh, I do have a mag. It takes 380 ACP. Damn. Didn't I just leave behind those 380 ACPs? Oh, now that seems kind of foolish. It was just back there, but... I think... No, I think it was a different ACP. I think it was different. That's a dope-looking church up there. Just trying to... Scope out our surroundings a little bit. Just see if I can spot anyone. Somebody lacking. Not seeing anything though, so we continue to move. You think I should go back for those bullets? Let's do it. Let's do it. It's just right here. I don't remember which of these sheds it was in. I think it was this one in the back. It was not that one. Didn't see those. Ah, this one. Those were 45 ACPs. I knew it was different. Wait, am I really out of room? Wow. I am. Um, hmm. Yeah, that dry sack. Uh, I think I'm going to just drop it for now. Because I'm, I'm not going to bury anything at the moment. And that shit takes up a lot of room. <clears throat> so here we go. Let's move in a little bit closer, carefully. I'm trying to be careful and value my life here. So what all do we got? Okay, we have the church with a well outside. I see a restaurant, police station. This, what I thought was military, I'm pretty sure is just a fucking fire fire station I don't think it shows you on the um, on this map the military zones it really doesn't show me the military zones on this map I'm looking at either if I'm being honest it's all good I know if I want military, I should probably head to an airfield or 
military base, something of the sort. I just kind of want to see the sights, though. You know what I mean? I've never been to Electro. It's my first time. Imagine that. If you've played DZ for a long time. This is my first time ever in Electro. Never been there. Whatever will I find? A fucking sickle. That's the last thing I would have expected to find. Who needs a sickle, dude? Oh. Bag of rice. Which is nice, because I was just starting to get kind of hungry. It's a big-ass bag of rice. Where was that there? Police station. Okay. Oh, they got medical too. Electro got the good loot. I need to get up closer to the main road though. I'm just nervous. I'm nervous, boy. Okay. Uh, Drop down. I'm on the railroad track. game is so good. It's so big. I mean, it makes you really feel like you're in a... Like, it sacrifices action. You know what I'm saying? But that is necessary to immerse you in a realistic environment. Wouldn't necessarily be realistic if you, like, ran into other players. You know what I mean? Like, all the time. That's not realistic, but like, never knowing when you're gonna run into someone or a group of people together, not knowing if they're friendly or not, bandits. Or maybe they are, you know, running into random kind of friendly travelers. It, it truly makes for an immersive post-apocalyptic experience. This is what I imagine it would be like. It's tense. It's nerve-wracking. Heard that? Oh fuck. Boy got a Christmas hat on. Oh, please don't see me. I just didn't want to alert him. doors are open. <laughs> uh, am I really about to just bum rush the police station? Fuck it, boy. Uh. Let's just wait momentarily. I like to run in buildings and then just sit for a second and turn around. That way, if somebody is stalking you, looking at you, chasing you. then they may just follow you up. But if they don't. Then. You know, you're probably safe. There's the police station. Oh, 
Oh boy. You hear the flies? Someone died in here. Oh, fucking dumbass. Damn. What kind of gun did he have? A Mosin? Is that better than the Tundra, you think? I don't know if it is or not. I wish I knew. I think I'm gonna keep the M70 Tundra. That guy is a recent casualty. I like how I'm pre-aiming and don't even know what the fucking building looks like. SG5K, polymer handguard, okay. Ooh, what is that, Scorpion? Should I take that instead of the Bezone? Um, it uses 380 ACPs. I have the, what, four? 45 ACPs. Another SG5K mag. Is that an SG5K? <laughs> it's a bison. Oh, it does have some bullets in it though. Um, okay, let me just... I, like, I wish I could just pull an unusual detachable magazine holds up to 64. Like, why was it that hard to detach that mag? Maybe I should just keep it on. I'll just throw the suppressor on this one. What kind of scope is this? I kind of like it, to be honest. I just need a battery. Um, okay, now we have a bison. We'll throw that bitch in full auto. Check all these rooms thoroughly. Fucking tire wrench. Okay. Whoever was here certainly left. Yeah, like, why can't I take the mag out of the. Like, you can take the pistol out, but I gotta. I gotta, like, grab the gun. And then fucking pull the mag out. Fuck all that. This does not seem like a roof. That you want to be on. So what do I do? I get on it. Okay, I got guns. I'm honestly thinking just hit medical. And then... And then I'll be, I'll be pretty damn looted at that point. I know the, the bison's not very good, and I definitely need some more bullets for this tundra, even though I don't even know what freaking bullets it takes. Some big ass ones? Some big ass bullets? Could it take, uh, I don't, I don't even know. Probably not those. What about those? No. 7.62s? Can't combine those. I think it's the wind, the Winchester. 
the Worcestershire bullets. We'll just have the bison ready. Okay. Um, cross the street up the hill. Go, go, go. Shit, I'm in the open. In the meantime, I'm going to take this side off. Will it fit there? Yeah. Okay. Just until I get a battery. I see the hospital. Let's get up in that shit. I hate these second floors of the hospitals. There's like never anything here. Oh, tetracycline uh, pills. Damn, I'm out of stuff. Um, fermented drink. I'm gonna just actually fuck the rag. Keep the drink for now. Okay, we got some tetracycline pills. Still not totally sure what those do. I'm pretty sure they're for acne. <laughs> Almost certain that's what I was on. Yeah, I really didn't find shit. I think the majority of the stuff here is like <clears throat> on the first floor, maybe. What is that? Oh, that's the rag I dropped. these rooms maybe uh oh an IV start kit we'll take that um damn I gotta start getting rid of some stuff gun cleaning kit what if I just fuck around and eat all my crunching crisps <clears throat> that'd probably do the trick clear a little bit of room for us boom um now we can grab that start kit what is that? Codeine pills, there we go. On the lookout for Sprite. No shit in that room. Yeah, like for a hospital. <clears throat> Blood test kit, okay, it's not, it's not the worst. Little, uh, <clears throat> little loot grab there. Well, I still haven't heard a single person. I have not heard a gunshot, seen movement, nothing. And we are dead center of Electra. about this fire station.
Dude, I freaking hate this because you can literally just be seen on the outside by anyone. I thought there was like always a staircase here. Yeah, to get up to that, to that room. Is it this staircase? I don't think so. Nope, that just sent me all the way to the top. Okay, well. I made it here. I don't know how. Yeah, there's a room up here. There's a different helmet. Not seeing much in the bathroom. Oh, my camera just died again. Well, that's probably a good spot to leave off this episode because <laughs> I got no more batteries left. Um, all right. Oh, I just had to go through that that door. All right. I think that's a good spot to leave off this episode. Thank you all so much for tuning in to this take on Daisy, and I will catch you right back here next time. If you did enjoy the video, be sure to leave a like if you didn't just refresh it and give it one more chance. And as always, guys, I don't really have a